Alright guys, here we go. Last Sunday was 221 something. Let's see what today is. Two nineteen four. I was hoping for more. But uh I don't know, two twenty one six to two nineteen four. I'll take a couple pounds over a week. It's uh Yeah, I'm a little disappointed, but overall not. Let me write this down so I don't forget. So, all right, that's my way in. I'm gonna get up and get my Sunday started. I'll check with y'all later. What's going on, guys? Uh, it's a beautiful damn day out. So today is a gym day, but considering it's nice out, I'm just gonna call it an exercise day. Uh, just came to this place uh, about 20 minutes from my house called Mount Trashmore. It gets its name because it's literally a landfill that was covered in soil, fertilized. Now it's basically a mountain. Uh, it's, I mean, it's, it's not big, but uh, running up it sucks. But uh, here's a view. Um, in just a second, um, when I got here, I basically warmed up with a long walk. See the parking lot like there? Uh, that's where I parked. I walked like all the way around there the trail goes almost to where you see the cars on the road around here and around the uh, front side of the uh, mountain here and, uh, so I got a good warm up and then uh, I was like screw it let's, uh, let's go ahead and start the cardio process I guess down the steps at least two more times and come up two more times just trying to get this uh trying to keep the heart rate up um i was walking to the edge to show you but i took a picture of the uh, incline i'll uh I'll just look right about nothing nothing extreme but like i said when you're out of shape trying to lose weight it's uh it sucks so, not a bad view from up here and here's everything you see Anyway, all right, I'm going to do that a couple more times. I'll uh, check with y'all in a bit. I'm going to embarrass myself. Here we go. Damn, that sucks. Guys, Whew, that was tough. I uh, uh, walked around the big loop, ended up running up and down the mountain about, uh, I think it's three or four times. And I'm spent. So, I'm gonna leave here. Gotta go back to Kroger. I forgot a couple things yesterday. Oh, damn, I'm tired now. Um, yeah. Get my usual Sunday done, and uh, I'll probably check in with you guys at least one more time before the end of the day. See ya. Yo, what's up, guys? It's, uh, I don't know, 4.30ish, somewhere around there. I'm not even, hold on, I can tell you. 4.23. Not that it really matters. I don't know why I feel like I need to tell you all that, like, every time I uh, record something. Uh, had a good afternoon. Like I said, still doing some food prep. I guess I'm still uh, sauteing some veggies. So we got like this much more to go and then add them to all this and throw some cheese in there uh so still doing some work uh 
So check this out. I used I had like an old uh, Google tablet. So I made a, a spreadsheet of all my common foods with all their macros, you know, calories, fat, protein, carbs. Uh, and then my buddy Greg, when he was here this weekend, he gave me an under-the-counter tablet holder or under the cabinet. I'm sorry. So check it out. Look at that. I, I hope it's showing up. But macros at eye level, baby. I love it. So uh, anyway, um, I just wanted to say hi, you know, because I'm, I'm, I'm kind of in a good mood. Uh, this afternoon was kind of tough. Like I, this afternoon, I I discovered a heartbreak I'd never felt before, and that's never good. Um, so I don't know if it's my stove or if it's uh, this new frying pan I've got. I've only had this frying pan for like three weeks. This is my third Sunday using it, and um, it's nice out. I have the back door open. Obviously, there's Tonka. Uh, I think I've showed you before. You know my front. Excuse me. The glass on my uh, front door rolls down to a screen, so I was getting I was getting some airflow through. But for some reason, when I was cooking bacon, it was just like steaming and smoking. So my fire alarm or my smoke alarm, hmm, excuse me, uh, ended up going off twice in five minutes, and it's loud. It's uh, um, like ear piercing uh drum busting noise um and it, it did it twice in five minutes and that poor tonka she was so spooked it was raining outside and she was much happier outside like under my truck so she's finally like back in the house but it ended up taking like her uh her cage uh usually stays in my bedroom and it ended up taking oh shucks i'm sorry i almost dropped you it ended up taking me getting her cage out of my room and bringing it in here for her to like come inside and uh then finally she started venturing out of her uh out of the cage a little bit so i think she, i think she's okay now but man that was like that was like legit heartbreaking so um anyway since i have you here uh I, th I think i'll just go ahead and finish this video off i'm gonna uh finish up my my meal prep um make my coffee make my breakfast and uh i don't know probably relax because it's gonna be a long week ahead uh tonka's got her her first big vet appointment tomorrow since i got her i've had her for like a little over just slightly over three months now um i'm gonna take her to the vet my parents have taken their dogs to for years now uh i mean she's got all of her you know, all of her uh shot records she's rabies free all that but i just kind of want to like get like a uh what my mom was called a well baby checkup. You know, just, I, I would just I just want her on record. You know, so that way if uh, you know if something happens in the future, I can take it back to the same vet, and they have like a you know something to compare it to. So looking forward to that. Not looking forward to the price tag, but I'm looking forward to that. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and call it a day. So again, my weigh in this morning was two nineteen point four. I'm going to hope for 216-something next Sunday. So uh, I, that'll be my goal. 216-something next Sunday. Cross your fingers for me, guys. Uh, just trying to make some moves. All right. Love y'all. Thanks for watching. Peace.